Hey guys, it's me. Um, I figure I might as well do a makeup tutorial for you guys since it's been a while. So I'm going to do this really bright, fun, crazy look that I do with some pro colors I have. Um, this is my pro palette. I'm going to be using the yellow and this blue. And I'll pop them out and double check what those colors are. Ah, the yellow is bright sunshine. And the blue is blue calm. So, to start out, I'm going to use my paint, which is base light. Ah. And for some reason, this tube has pressure on it, so it came out pretty quick. So, I'm just going to take a little bit of it, like that, and spread that across each lid make sure it's well dispersed you don't want to get too much anywhere and then the cool my favorite thing about the paints is it stays crease free for at least eight hours as long as you're using it right so in the paint pots they say six hours So, there we go. Just a little bit of extra. And then I'm going to take my 230 brush, a little white brush. I've been using it for yellow, so. I'm going to pack this bright sunshine on the inside of my lid, the inner half. And then if you really want the yellow to be brighter, you can use the cream base. I have the Screaming Yellow Cream Base. That'll make it much brighter. Okay. And then this is the 212, I believe. Um, and I'm using this one in the blue calm. And this is going to go on the outer half. And then I'd say the easiest way for people to order Pro Store colors, if you are not a Pro member, is to just call any Pro Store. And from what I hear, they'll just let you order through credit card and ship it to you. Okay, so there's that. And then my crease is going to be bright fuchsia. Super fun color. Really, really bright. Hence the name. And this is my 217 brush. I last used it in like the red, so it's going to have a little bit of the residue in it. And this is going to go on that outer crease and then gently working it inwards.
there's that part. Super bright, super fun. Then, for my lower lash line, I'm just going to take the yellow and the blue and get them to kind of tie together underneath. Do the yellow from the inside to the outer half. Then we shall take the blue comb. The blue comb tends to give fallout, so you gotta tap out the brush. There's that. Then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to line my waterline with feline. It's the blackest black that you can find. It's amazing. If you can still get it at your Mac store, I recommend buying a few. So, just take it and follow your lash line. So there's that. And then the mascara that I have been kind of falling in love with, that everybody else loves, Lash Blast. Um, but this is the waterproof one. I like this one because it gives a more um, separated look. So go ahead and put that on. And with a look as bright as this, you gotta do two coats. And then another cool trick that I learned with your lower lash line, if you want to enhance the appearance even more, make your lashes look even longer. Um, the best way to do that is when you're putting your mascara on, pull those lashes inward. Like that. Then I'm going to throw another coat on my top lash line. There's that. I also need to do a highlight color. For that, I'm going to use Dazzle Light in my highlight palette. And just brush it on and blend the edge of that hot pink, too. So. There's that. Then a little bit of blush. I use True Romantic. And then for lip gloss. I'm going to use Opal. It's a luster glass.
so there we go. The completed look. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.